That's the sort of thing that can ground you in, in your life enough so that you can withstand the difficulty of life. And when you tell people that, especially when you include yourself in the audience, let's say, and you're not finger waving from above, then everyone knows that it's true. There's been this attempt to identify masculine competence and, and power, let's say, but mostly competence with tyranny. And that's very, very hard on, on young men. It's also hard on young women for that matter. But it's very helpful for people to hear that they should make themselves competent and dangerous and take their proper place in the world because it's the alternative to being weak. And weak is not good. The people who shoot up the high schools, they're weak. They're weak. And life is a very difficult process. And you're not prepared for it unless, unless you have the capacity to be dangerous. That doesn't mean that you should be cruel. It doesn't mean any of that. There's a statement in the New Testament, the meek shall inherit the earth. But the meek isn't well translated. It means something more like, those who have swords and know how to use them but keep them sheathed will inherit the world. That's a way better way of thinking about it.